beneficiaries of the Center for Human Health and Development, Chad Medical Outreach Program, are residents of Tunga Wakili, a remote community some 16 kilometers from the Abuja airport. Services provided by the visitors include free consultations, diagnosis, and medical drugs. They were also presented with gifts of clothing and other relief materials. The chief of Tonga Wakili, Isa, is thanking you people of your coming and receiving with joy with happiness. And uh, he's not saying that he's, uh, he wants you to come, the Lord that will carry you to come here to bless anyone that step here in Jesus' name. Before you see Dr. Fron Zuba or Tunga Madi, before you see any hospital, we hear many here suffering for treatment. We are so glad, so happy that you people have come over with the issue of giving us drugs free. There is not any hospital, now let God help us shortly. The chat team, in explaining the motive of their gesture, stated that minor health challenges often turn critical, while some result in death due to lack of basic Medicare. They enjoined privileged individuals and organizations to occasionally reach out with medical assistance to the poor in rural areas. Rich people, please, let me ask this question. What will you be remembered for? What will... Each of us, we will die at a point. What would people say this man, this woman, did for the less privileged or did to help others in need? When it's a small headache, you run to a hospital, you run to a medical practitioner, and they will cover it from the ball. But in the village, they go at the point of death. Most of them at that time get help. Some don't. And even when they get help, because it has degenerated so bad, nothing can be done, they will lose their life. And that was the reason why most of us gathered ourselves together and said, what do we do to help these less privileged? At least to live long and give their children future. The chat team comprised doctors, nurses, pharmacists, and other health therapists. In Abuja, Kama Kama, NTA News.